Welcome everybody to the Pocket Pipe Calculator Overview. Uh, we're just going to go through the application, show you guys what this, uh, what this app has available for you. Uh, this app should be released to market in the next few days. I'm just running through the application, make sure everything looks good. Uh, what you're looking at here is the main menu. And you'll see an image with a, a standard offset, a rolling offset, and then we have uh, an offset with a reducing T. You scroll down here, you see back-to-back -back fittings. You can have odd angle fittings here. You've got a 90 with an odd angle fitting. Uh, we've got another option available for uh, the same layout, but it has a slider in it. And I'll show you what that is. And this one here is a slider as well. You scroll down, you have miscellaneous calculations. And you'll see this is for takeout of any angle fitting. Uh, you've got a two-hole alignment for flanges. And then you've also got uh, just a back-to-back -back fitting if you want to know what the takeout is. Now uh, scroll down a little further, we have chart data, uh, basically in inches for imperial, and then we have uh, millimeters for metric. Uh, you also see our shortcut buttons for the other applications, if there's anything that uh, we have that you'll need in the field. Uh, and then, of course, on the bottom row, we have a link to our Facebook page our YouTube page, uh, LinkedIn, as well as our website. Uh, we'll scroll back up and we'll do a brief run through of some of the screens. Uh, we'll start with the odd angle offset. Uh, there's five tabs at the bottom. We're on the settings tab when you first enter the screen. You have the option of DIN, Imperial, and metric settings. Uh, you have the option to choose your pipe size, set the root gap. Uh, you can set one root gap or two. Um, you can also set the radius for your fittings. These are some shortcuts. This is the multiplier to determine the takeout of a fitting. If you uncheck that box, you can set the radius to be different for each fitting if required. Uh, we also have the option of using a factory 45 or a custom cut fitting. Uh, this, is, this only comes into play if your calculation actually utilizes 45 degree fittings and you, uh, you have your fittings supplied to you. There are different takeouts uh, from four inch and below uh, that do not use the standard formula. So we try to take into account um, those there so that way we have an accurate uh, calculation for you. You'll see a help section. Um, there's a video. Uh, there's also just a text help that if you click the buttons, you can uh, read a description of what the application does for you. That's a brief run through of the settings, which is pretty common in all of the screens. Uh, the screen here, we have a home tab. And you notice your offset uh, has an odd angle and it goes to a 90. You can toggle that first fitting and that'll swap. Uh, either that's vertical, then you have 90 east, 90 west. You can swap to the second fitting. You can swap that to 90 east, west. It can also go vertical. Um, so you have a, an array of options here for this, this offset. Um, we scroll down, you have input values for A and B. Uh, fitting 2, um, a lot of this will change depending on what your settings are. It shows fitting 2 here and that's uh, to determine what the actual angle is if you know what it is. Uh, fitting 1 is a 90, so you actually do not have to do anything with that. Uh, bolt holes if you need flanges. Uh, the cut pipe section will give you the angle for fitting one, the cut length and fitting two. There's also more detailed information here uh, just to show you the travel and the offset, the cut length and then, or the pipe length and then the cut length based on your root gap. Here's some fitting data. Uh, this will show you the angle of the fitting, it'll show you the takeout of the fitting, and it'll show you the dimensions to cut a custom fitting out of a 90 and you'll be able to toggle back and forth from fitting one to fitting two. Uh, your flanges, this will give you a two hole alignment for fabricating horizontally in the bench in order to give you an accurate two hole in the field. Uh, that's the basic rundown for that screen. The rolling offset, uh, you'll see that basically everything's the same uh, except you have on the uh, home tab, uh, your image is different. You have the option of swapping uh, from an east-west, a north-south, or a vertical uh, as it enters into the offset and then the exiting uh, offset is the same way. It can toggle east and west, north-south, or vertical. 
Uh, there's quite an array of options here as well. Uh, you can also choose an elevation view or a plan view um, to kind of help with your drawing if you need it. Uh, you have the options here similar to the other screen where you have input A, B, and C. Uh, and then all the other things are the same. You have the ability for cut pipe. Um, these buttons won't become available until you hit calculate. Uh, it kind of keeps the flow going so you actually operate the app correctly. Uh, we'll scroll back here. You've got your odd angle with your T. Um, these are fittings uh, with your takeout. Um, the only thing available is the home tab fittings and settings. Uh, you would enter your C value here and and then you would it basically would calculate what two uh, fittings you would need in order to uh, create that offset for a back-to-back -back connection. Uh, this one here is a rolled uh, 90 with a custom fitting. Uh, this is a back-to-back -back fitting, so you don't have any uh, any putt piece in between that would it would reduce the number of welds. We also have a slider. Um, this is a more uh, hands-on approach. Uh, you would enter in your pipe OD, the radius of the first fitting, the radius of the second fitting, root gap, and your C value, and you just move the slider until your stub piece is zero, and that'll be that'll tell you the angle of the fitting that you need. More hands-on approach. Uh, some people might like that better. Uh, it's the same way with the uh, 90 into the odd angle. Uh, same approach there. Um, we scroll down. Let's see if we show you the odd angle fitting. Uh, you just pick the pipe size and the angle of the fitting and you set the radius and then it'll calculate all the information for you. Uh, the flange, the two hole, if you calculate, uh, if you enter in your A and B value, uh, you'll see up here how they correspond to the, uh, the offset in the field. It will tell you the degree in which to rotate your flange in order to get a proper two hole in the field. Very handy tool for those that, that do not know how to calculate that angle. Um, and then we have your basic take out of your fittings. Uh, you would just do the pipe size, root gap, and the angle and it will give you the, um, the detail for that. Uh, as you can see here you've got A1, A2, B, C, D, and E and you can see how they correspond to the drawing. Uh, and then of course you have your fitting information so you can do a custom cut fitting if you need to. Uh, let's see, we'll click on pipe charts. Uh, as you run through, these are pretty standard in the apps. Uh, this is all Imperial. you got Schedule 40 standard, Schedule 80 extra strong, Schedule 60 and double extra strong. Also comes in the uh, metric values. Uh, very handy to have. Keeps you uh, from having to pull out your blue book. Uh, that's a basic run through of the application. It's constantly growing. Uh, this is our new new update with our new layout. And uh, look forward on the marketplace. And uh, come see us on Facebook. And we'd love to hear your feedback. Thanks.